Welcome to position of the week 10. I'm Grandmaster Jab Ogo uh, from killerchesstrain.com. If you want to know more about what we're doing, you can always visit our website. The position I want to show this week is from uh, the game between Leon Luc Mendonca or Mendonca and uh, Abi Mishra. So Abi won this game with black and beat the record for youngest grandmaster in history. Um, this was partly possible because he played a lot of tournaments in a row with actually a lot of the same opponents, um, but also with a rating average of, I think, 2390, um, which is very close to the lowest you can have uh, to make GM norms, but uh, records are made uh, according to the rules, and uh, these are the rules. So in this position here, it's white to play. Black has just played knight d2. And white could have won the game in several ways. Um, he could have played b4 and then played the king to the uh, to the king side and eradicate the pawn, or he could play king e6 immediately also. Um, instead, in this position, white played a very natural looking move, king e5. And this is a uh, mistaken for several reasons. So we should understand both players are in time trouble. One of the reasons is that uh, after knight c4, knight e3, uh, black is in time to make a draw here. Um, but actually, Abi he found a much more tricky option. He played knight f3. And the question is now, should white take this bishop or should he play king f6? What do you think? Give it a, a think, stop the video, press spacebar, and then see the solution. Okay, so the, the best move for white is king f6. And the queen ending that arises by force here is just, just a draw. Uh, it could be a draw in this way. On the other hand, in the game, White decided to take the knight after takes bishop h4. The pawn looks to be under control. I assume that White has expected something like uh, king takes e3 and then king f6. And white is winning. But instead black had g5. And now the bishop is not able to uh, keep its position on uh, the diagonal from e1 to h4. If uh, bishop g3, black will play h4. So in the game, white played bishop f2, then came king e2, and uh, with king g1, then uh, we have several ways to win. I think the simplest is king f1, king e4, and g4. Um, in the game white tried b4 but it was not working and white resigned in this position as after b8 queen f4 he would uh, lose his uh, newly created queen and this is not the most beautiful game of all time but uh, you should see the one where I made my first I am norm that was much worse than this so I just want to wish Abby uh, congratulations and all the best in the future. And uh, I look forward to seeing him uh, as soon as it's possible. I hope you enjoyed this. And if you did, if you're interested, killchesstraining.com. See you there.